to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about reading or understanding box plots, also called, called box and whisker plots. If you need to know how to set one up, I'll leave a link in the show notes that, to a couple videos that show you how to create a box and whisker plot. Okay, let's first look at what information it tells you. Let's first look. The middle quartile is the median or the middle piece of data. Next, it shows you the two extremes. You have the lower extreme here and the upper extreme there. So we'll put extremes here. Next, you have the lower quartile. And what the lower quartile is, and it's right here, is the median of the lower set of data. So it's the data between 82 and 60. And then it tells you the upper quartile and that is the median between 82 and 99 okay so there's kind of an outline and so sometimes you'll have questions such as these so let's look at the box and box and whisker and see if we can't figure this out first what would be the lowest test score well if we look we look at the two extremes and the lowest would be 60. remember the goal of any graph or a box plot is that it helps you visualize the information so it helps you uh, very quickly figure out uh, numbers and what things are next you have the highest test score and that would be 99 okay again that's the upper extreme and what is the median see it's very easy it's the middle quartile the median of this set of data would be 82 and then finally the range well to get the range we take the two extremes. So we have the upper extreme, 99 minus 60, and that equals 39. So the range is 39. Okay, let's look at another one and see if we can't do the same thing. Again, let's look at the numbers. We have the two extremes. We have the low extreme, the upper extreme. We have the median right here, which is 35. We have the lower quartile which is remember the medium of this lower set of data right here and then the upper quartile so the lowest test score again we just go down to the extreme and that would be 10. the highest test score the other extreme which is 60. the median remember it's right in the middle so that's going to be 35. and the range again we take the high minus the low which is 60 minus 10 and that equals 50 so the range is 50. okay next we have a question what is the median of the lower range of data and that you know the median is right here and that would be 20. lower quartile gives you the medium of the lower data and what's the median of the upper quartile and that would be the upper quartile and that is 50. I hope that helps in reading a box and whisker plot. Remember, Moving Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.